Alright guys, what is going on? Welcome back to an episode of our Pokemon Storm Silver Egg Lock. Hopefully you guys are having yourselves a great day today. And if you want to go ahead and support the episode, make sure you go ahead and drop a like down below. Of course, your support is greatly appreciated. So, here we are in the radio tower because the objective in this episode is to actually go ahead and take on Archer, I do believe. I think that's what we have to do now. And I think that's the upcoming boss fight. So that is going to be scary. That's all I can really say because I, I, I don't even know... What Pokemon is going to have, what level is going to be, and I can only imagine this is going to be really hard. I would not be surprised if this goes very south, but either way, our team is looking fire as usual. I'm starting off with a fire type. Look at me, my unintentional punts. Either way, we have Nano, the Typhlosion with Flamethrower, Lava Plume, Thunder Punch, a Quick Attack, Meatball, the Azumarill with Aqua Tail, Surf, Iron Tail, and Aqua Jet, Zombie, the Leafy on with Psycho Cut, Bite, Razor Leaf, and Aerial Ace, Shaggy, the Dom Fair with Takedown, Earthquake, Ice Shard, Toxic, Z Zashka, Zashka. Yeah, I just gotta get in the habit of saying it. I'm pretty sure it's Zashka. There we go. I just gotta get in the habit of that. The Tri Attack, Nasty Plot, Extra Sensory, and Fly, and last but not least, Orum, the Luxray with Crunch, Ice Fang, Fire Fang, and Spark. And you know what? I don't know why he just has the Magnet. He has so much coverage. I think the Expert Belt would be pro. I think that'd probably be a better item. I think that's good. Alright. So I guess we're just gonna lead off with Nano. Kill something with the choice specs, um what's it called? Choice specs flamethrower. I'm really nervous for this fight. You've arrived at the observation deck. Well here we go, guys. We're all we're, we're all good, right? Healed up. What about moves? Five out of ten try attacks, we might need those. You never know. You never know. You gotta be prepared for anything. Alright, well without further ado, let's do it. Oh, you managed to get this far yet again. You must be quite the trainer. We have taken over the radio tower and officially announced our comeback. That should bring our boss Giovanni back from his solitary training. We are going to reign for former glory. I will not allow you to interfere with our mil malicious plans. I think that's what the word was. Malicious? I just didn't see it. It's not that I couldn't read it. I just clicked A before I could even look at that word. Alright. Zangoose lead. So he is 46, so his ace is probably gonna be around us, so this is gonna be a little scary. If we were a lot if we were over leveled, I wouldn't be that scared, but for the time being, I don't wanna do this. I really don't wanna do this, but you have to. We have to. And there's a kill. Easy. Nano is so good. I don't know who I don't know who sent a nano, but shout out to you. That's all I have to say. Gyarados. Okay, um. I don't really have a, a better play here. I mean, I don't like the fact that Intimidate is going to hit us, but... Or it's going to drop our attack, but... You never know. You never know. This could just absolutely destroy... Oh, two Intimidates. I just I forgot. Alright, so... Are you... Actually, are you dragon type in this game? I don't think so. I, I didn't think so. And... Still going to one-shot. I'm actually really impressed. I see you, Orum. I'm a champ. I'm gonna try and set up on this thing. I'm getting so many notifications. I'm gonna mute my phone. It's just distracting. I see it out of the corner of my eye, and I'm like, what's this? Uh, nasty plots. And I can go for extra sensory on this thing. Go. Oh, no. Oh, that's no bueno. That is no bueno. Please miss. Or, or go for cross chop. Oh, God. Holy crap, dude. That's actually insane. So we, so we just crits everything. Is that what this thing does? This is scary, bro. We don't have anything for this Machamp. I have Psycho Cut, and that's about it. How much is that gonna do? If we get a crit, it'll, it'll be amazing, but... Cause he can just crit us with Cross Chop.
I would totally toxic this thing, but it could have guts. And I don't want to make that mistake. So I'm just gonna Earthquake and then Ice Shard. He's probably just gonna heal, which kind of sucks, but... Whatever. Please don't kill. Well, the thing is, if he tries to Earthquake here... I, I was gonna say, not Earthquake. If we go for Earthquake here, either we get the kill because we're faster, or we do some damage because he needs, uh, he needs health. And he's gonna heal himself. And we still do pretty good damage, I'm not gonna lie. It's just... God. Just so much damage. I just heal up. That's probably the best play. That is nothing. So we should be good. Even with a crit, I think we can live, so... We, I think we handled that pretty well. There we go. There we go. Handle the Machamp. Scary, scary Pokemon. Oh my god. Houndoom. Now I'm only afraid if this thing has Sunny Day as well as Sword Beam. Because then you could probably kill my meatball. You can kill my meatball. <laughs> but as for now, I think this plus Aqua Jet, even with the minus one, is, is going to decimate this thing. Yeah. That did a lot. Even, that was a crit, obviously, but still. Oh, I had a Focus Dash. I didn't even see that. So it would have killed, probably. But it's dead. It is definitely dead. Drapion. I was going to shag you for this thing. So this boss fight's going decent so far. It's going decent so far. The Machamp was really scaring the hell out of me, but... Oh, Aqua to hello? Can I live that? Oh, I, I lived that with ease. Get out of here. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. God, I freaking love that movie. Have you, got, have you seen Elf? Good movie. Good movie. It's Will Ferrell. A lot of people don't like Will Ferrell. And I don't know how I feel about him exactly, but I love him in that movie. I don't know. It's a Christmas movie, so if you don't celebrate Christmas, I highly doubt you've seen it. Maybe you have. I don't know. But I think it's a good movie. Alright, and that's a quote from it. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. Alright, so Scizor. Alright. Now, can I kill you with a flamethrower? Will this choice spec staff flamethrower kill a, kill a Scizor? Let's find out. Oh my god. Let's see. Well, it seems that the HP bar is falling rather fast. Does that mean that... Oh my god, it one-shot. What are the chances? I, I don't know, man. That was that was pretty savage. Of, nano. God, Archer's sprite makes him look like freaking drunk off his ass. How could this be? Our dreams have, our dreams have come to naught. Uh, I was not up to task after all. Like Giovanni has done before, I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. What if he just jumped out of the window. Is that Giovanni? I forgot he comes here. Giovanni, sir, you've returned. My arrival was marked by a kid beating a Team Rocket executive. Disgraceful. Listen, kid, you've gotten yourself involved in growing up matters. I will show you- Oh, no. Oh, no. Please say we're fully healed. Okay, good. I was gonna say. So I don't know in that process who healed me, where I got healed. I don't really care either. Oh, we missed the hypnosis. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Alright. Easy. One shot. I was gonna say, if we have to do this battle, with a bunch of weak Pokemon, we were gonna lose. That was just gonna be the game right there. And I was willing to lose there. Like, I was ready. I was ready. I was thinking of my my post everyone dies speech. Like, thank you guys so much for watching. I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed this playthrough. Holy crap, it's level 50! We're all gonna act like we didn't know that was gonna one shot. Like, come on. That was easy kill. Easy freed. Nido King. I'm staying in. What what do you think this is? Oh sh I forgot you get a lot of coverage. I don't know. I was thinking ice beam, sludge bomb. I, I don't know why I didn't think Thunderbolt. I don't know why. 
But thank God we're hitting all these Aqua Tails. I know I shouldn't have said anything because that means we're going to miss the next one for sure. But for the time being, shout out to Meatball. Shout out to my Meatball. <laughs> Wish I could erase that quote from my memory. So is Nidoqueen coming out? Kangaskhan, okay. I want to get the, what's it called off? The Intimidate off on this thing. I feel like that's going to be pretty important. So let's see, what does Kangaskhan do in this game? I don't know. I also feel like he's going to have Earthquake or something. Yep, there it is. So I wanted to switch out. And I'm pretty sure Earthquake couldn't have killed us considering... I meant to go for Toxic, but I didn't click right on my controller. I'm pretty sure the Earthquake wouldn't kill considering the Intimidate, but still, I don't want to risk anything. Because if he gets a crit, that's, you know, the uh, minus is completely negated. Alright, um, I'm going to heal here barring the... Not barring, just in case of the crit. I, don't, I just don't want to deal with that right now. That would just be depressing. Double edge. And I think that means we can go... I didn't even know this Giovanni battle was here. It, this isn't in the normal games, right? This is a pure Storm Silver thing. How Giovanni comes after and he makes you battle him. And when he pulled up, I just thought he was going to say some stuff and be like, we got a lot of talent, kid. Come in here disbanding Team Rocket. <laughs> but no, instead he tries to battle us, which is insane. All right. Well, you know, Queen, you could have Ice Beam. I don't want to mess with this thing. I want the Intimidate off, and then I'm going to go straight out into um, Meatball. Wait, was that a good play? Oh, yes, it was. Easy. Toxic. Easy. I didn't know it could get any easier than this. Still haven't missed a single, a single Aqua Tail. Single Aqua Tail. I'm going straight for the Aqua Jet. Wow, he hadn't even used a full restore yet, I don't think. That's why that was, he used that one. Really? You're going to try and Toxic Stall me? Is that what we do? Is that what we do now? Very well, very well. I'll let you do that. I'll, I'll leave you to it. I'll leave you to it. Oh, we went for the double? Oh, kill yourself. Jeez, I, I was holding it back, but come on. Come on now. Is this his last Pokemon? No, it's not. I'm going for Nasty Plot. On the Protect. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. You gotta set up when you can. I actually thought he was gonna go for another one. And then he went for Ice Beam. Nice. That definitely worked out. I want to go for this. I don't know why. I really don't. I should have just healed there, but whatever. He's dead. Wait, are we gonna die to the poison? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Thank you! Thank god we have the leftovers. Oh my gosh. My plan for this thing is Intimidate and then... Um, and then Leafy on. Cause I don't know what the hell else am I gonna do. We're gonna eat up that Earthquake for sure, so... Yeah, that's a nothing. Wait, do you have Sap Sipper? Do I want to find out? Not really. Because that could be really bad. That we gave this thing Sap Sipper. Or not gave it Sap Sipper, but you know what I mean. Um, I'm going to heal up Shaggy. And I'm just going to switch out into Shaggy. And go for Earthquake and finish this thing off. Or at least should finish it off. Alright, well, that should be the end of Tauros. There we go. And then we just beat Giovanni and Archer. Back to back. What in the world? That's what I'm saying, jeez. So once again, a child defeats Team Rocket. Is Team Rocket forever doomed to be defeated by mere children? I don't know, buddy. And then the happy music just starts playing. What's up, buddy? Uh, you've already defeated them. Thank you. Uh, your courageous actions have saved Pokemon nationwide. Please take it. The Silver Wing. Oh my god, we're getting we're getting pretty far in the game. There used to be a tower right here. When the tower was replaced with the radio tower, that Silver Wing was found at the top of the tower. I heard from a friend from uh, Cianwood City that you can go to the cave at World Islands if you have the Silver Wing. Uh, I have to get back to my office. Oh, I almost forgot. According to my friend from Cianwood City, the legendary Pokemon will not appear for you. 
if you just go down to the cave at World Islands with only that silver wing. Apparently there's something else you need. Dude, just rem you can't remember anything. Are you expecting something? This is what they call fake out. What? I thought he was about to give us the TM for fake out. I was like, hey, I'll take it. I will take that definitely. All right, well, let's just heal the poison. So when we walk, no one freaking dies. And let's get out of here. Well, we did that. That was not really almost bad because we handled those battles pretty well. It's just like they could have been really bad considering, you know, the amount of Pokemon and the caliber of Pokemon. High levels, high, high amount of Pokemon, good Pokemon. That's that's the main concern. But you know what? We're good. We handled it. Shout out to us. Shout out to the God Squad, though. Really. Are there any Pokemon that we have to swap out for eggs? I don't remember. No? Wow, there isn't. Voltackle. Interesting. Alright, so... I guess our mission now is Blackthorn City. I believe so. I believe so. Okay. Actually... Yeah, we can do that now. Route 44, because we can get some encounters. And we can hatch them at the beginning of next episode. Because there are some encounters that we missed. We missed a, um, the gift cast form. The gift flying Pikachu. You just need to show a Pokemon with max happiness. And I can just show Togekiss, considering it needed max happiness to evolve. Um, unless it was faking. Um, who else? Or what else, I guess I should say. I don't really remember. Oh well. It doesn't matter. Let's get that Ultra Ball. I need to get an encounter, jeez. Electrizer! There we go! So now we can use an Electrovire if we want to. So there's the Ice Path, okay. Damn, look at all these trainers. Insane. Aw, oh, dang it. I just want the item. Oh, I know there's the... There's a grass patch in that little lake, right? Not lake, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Espeon. Let's kill this fast. I just realized that we don't have a psychic type, so if we wanted to, we could use an Espeon. We could, if we wanted to. Adios, amigo. I mean, we're using a Leafeon, so I don't really want to use an Espeon now, but... If anything happens to Leafeon, and we need a psychic type... Aw, uh, speaking of psychic types. This is sad times right here. Really sad. Rip Brandy, man. I'm still really upset. Such a good team member. I wonder what I wonder if Giraffe Rig would be doing work right now in the game. Or is it like about you know time where Giraffe Rig would start to get kinda kinda dead weight? I don't know. Cause like it's fun to use early game because it's definitely not a bad Pokemon early game, but oh this is our first encounter. I was just about to say. I'll take it. It doesn't matter, obviously. One, two, three, boom. There we go. And I can't even get this. It's a Lickitung! Oh my god! I love Lickitung. Max Revive. Well, thank you for that amazing item. I really appreciate it. It's the most useful item. Also, I want... Where are Entei and Raikou? All the way over there. I want them to show up so they can run up. Um, let's just go get the Pokemon that I was talking about. So I'll, I need to get a space open in my party. Is this dude to the right always there? I don't remember him. I don't remember him there. Huh. You won, didn't you? Your face tells me you did. Yeah, I mean, I guess so. Um, for a second I thought he, I don't know, he reminded me of the metal guy. That gives you like the metal box, or the stuff in the metal box in um, Heart Gold Soul Silver. Not Heart Gold Soul Silver, black and white. Hello, a Pikachu was washed up on the shore. It seems it was surfing but collapsed. Are you a trainer? That Pokemon leading your Oh. Wow, that we actually have Max Hat. Oh, yeah, I forgot. It was an Azrael. So we got Pikachu. Do you know what the battle frontier? Uh, we may meet again if you visit the battle thing. A battle? No, I cannot do that. Sorry. When did I ask for that? Either way, we now have this Pikachu that knows Surf and Fly.
I just realized we needed a surfer and a flyer. And there's the perfect Pokemon. All right, well, either way, we can't keep it, unfortunately. Uh, we will have to swap it out. But either way, I think that's uh, pretty cool that they try to give that to you there. Just to add some more uniqueness to the Pokemon you can capture and stuff like that. All right, um, let's move you over here. There we go. Now let's go talk to our homeboy, Bill. Yeah, so they don't give you an Eevee because they, or he doesn't give you an Eevee because Cynthia gives you an Eevee. And that'd be, that'd be stupid if they gave you two Eevees. Yes, I would like to. And no, I would not like to nickname it. I think it's holding the Mystic Water, right? Yeah. Nice, that's a free Mystic Water. Is there anything else we can do? I'm trying to think. Is there anything else we can do? That I forgot. We can get an encounter in New Bark Town. We never did this. Oh. Shit, I just realized that, yeah, that's Route 27. So we can get two encounters here. So this is the one for New Bark Town. There we go. Just some more things we can do if we ever need some team members. Route 27. Wow, see, look at that level jump. Oh my god. That level jump is insane. Still an easy catch, though. You know, you already know me. Easy catch is my middle name. Alright, um... Oh, sh crap, we can't even fly there. We just gotta go right there. That's so funny. You can't fly if you're right on that tile. But as soon as you walk over, it's completely fine. Cherry Grove, Azalea, Violet City, Ecruteak. I think that's about all of them that we can go to. Alright, so... We got some encounters. We did exactly what we needed to do. And, um... Why don't we do... We'll do two right now. And then, uh, we'll call it an episode. How about we do just that? All right, there we go. How about right there? Lullaby. I love that nickname. That's awesome. Well, is that a, oh, please be a Chingling. Maybe it's a Jigglypuff. A Chingling would be sweet. I would love to use a Chimeco. I would have to use that instead of Espeon. That's a really cool nickname. I like this. A Shuppet. The controller just stopped working again for some reason. Really this never really happened. I think it's happened three times. Total of, total of three? I don't know. Throughout the whole playthrough, so it's not even like it's something that's been happening where I need to look into it. It's just probably like a defect that's going on. And that Pokemon didn't have an item on it when I uh, pulled it out of the PC, so. Alright, so now we'll be in box eight. So this one. Wow, look at that. We have a full box of inactive Pokemon. That's insane. That is insane. Alright, so now we're over here. So... Let's jump to box 8. Oh, I thought I could just jump there. Never mind, oh well. We can do that though. Oh no, it was 9? Yeah, it was 9. There we go. Alright, um, we'll do... Top left. Durgan holding TM26. Is that Earthquake? Oh, don't tell me. Yo, we got another Earthquake TM! That's awesome. So what is this thing named during? And we still haven't even got the main one in the game, so we can still get one more. Which is perfect. I love how we get that right after Don Fandler's Earthquake, though. That's funny. D-E-R-G-I-N. Alright, come on. Hatch, Durgan. What is it gonna be, a Gibble? I don't know, I feel like that's a Gibble. I don't know why, I don't know why I'm thinking Gibble. I was, I was kind of joking. The reason why is because it took a while, it took a while to hatch and Durgan just sounds like a, I swear I, I didn't know. I don't even know how I would know. Like I could have like seen the nickname Durgan and then be like, oh, let me check. It's a Gibble, but there's not really a point to that. Why would I do that? And I, I don't freaking know. And why would I choose up until now to hatch the Gibble? I swear that was all, I just guessed and 
I don't freaking know. And I was just going off. If it had to be like a pseudo legend or something, because it took a while to hatch. It looks like Lotad is crying in his sprite in the box. You see, that looks like a teardrop. Oh, I'm sorry, Lotad. What a nice guy. All right, well, that's going to conclude that uh, hatching portion. And I think it's also going to include, uh, ex include, that's also going to be the ending of the episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure you drop a like down below. Of course, the support is greatly appreciated. Next episode, we'll be going to be traveling through Ice Path and to Blackthorn City. And also, I don't think I'm going to be recording another episode after this. If you missed out on the last episode, essentially, I had to bulk record three videos. So I just recorded the episode for Friday. It is currently um, March 31st. And I just recorded this for the April, uh, for April 7th. No, no, no. I recorded this for April um, 9th. So it's the 9th as I'm recording this, and I wanted to have a video for the 10th being Monday, uh, but I don't think I'm going to do that, so you won't see me in this shirt again, or this hoodie, I guess I should say, which I love, by the way, I love this hoodie. And, uh, yeah, I don't know, I guess you guys want to have a video for tomorrow, I do apologize, but you gotta understand, also I gotta work with my schedule, I gotta pack still, and, uh, I don't know. It's gonna be weird, because by the time you guys see this, I'm gonna be back, and I don't freaking know, maybe I'll just record a video when I get back. And you guys will have a video for tomorrow. I don't freaking know. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll uh, catch y'all later. Uh, what's it, the next episode, it's like the Ice Path, Blackthorn City, stuff like that. I don't know. Either way. Hope it Let's just see what she has to say. It has to be important. It has to be important. How are you? You know, I've heard sometimes Pokemon will find things along Route 27. Thank you. Thank you. With that, I think there's nothing else I can do but just end the episode. Peace out, guys.